When I start working on a new album or a new track, I already have an idea about what I want and how it should sound like. Um, I have samples, um, sounds and ideas collected to play around with, which doesn't necessarily mean uh, that everything is strictly planned already. I think it's quite important to leave things open, to leave space for things to happen in the flow. And um, I feel quite blessed to be able to create things and express myself through creation. Talking about inspiration, I think uh, that's the crucial part. No matter what you do in life, whether it's uh, working from nine to five or creating music or paintings, uh, you won't be happy with yourself without being truly inspired. So to me, it definitely all starts with inspiration. Describing my music or music in general, I think is like trying to explain the meaning of love. It is quite difficult, but I, I think I can say that um, intimacy, soul, the strength of both pain and happiness are the basic ingredients in all of my songs and tracks. Our lives are full of stories of the past and the present and um, we all go through different phases in life uh, the good times and the bad times but the funny thing is there's always one song that reminds us of a certain situation and that song can trigger proper little movies inside our heads and um, take us right back in time so I think both the memories and the songs I would call soul stickers I am definitely addicted to music. I mean, I'm always interested in finding out about new bands or projects um, of all different styles. Um, I really love the Motown sound. Marvin Gaye is my all-time favorite artist. Um, Otis Redding, Bobby Womack, Stevie Wonder. I really love Depeche Mode. I'm a big, big fan ever since. Um, Thomas Dolby, Gary Newman. And I like bands like Fisher Set, The Bench Connection, Nick Drake, the Divine Comedy, The Blue Nile, Kings of Leon, The Streets, Aoife Cassidy, The Blue State, uh, also Marillion, Roxy Music, I could go on forever. Um, I simply think it's important to open up because there's so much fantastic music to find out about. I mean, one wouldn't have the same food for dinner every day. Uh, so what's the point in sticking to only one style? I think it has to do with inspiration and, and life offers so many different situations and it's pure luxury to have the right soundtrack at the right time. And it also can have a healing factor in a way. So that's why I love music. Since music has always been and will always be a true companion in my life, I think it's quite difficult to point out that one favorite album of all times because I think I have lots of favorite albums. Um, some of them are definitely Marvin Gaye in our lifetime. Depeche Mode, Construction Time Again, means a lot to me, that album. Uh, Marillion, Misplaced Childhood, fantastic music. Kraftwerk, Computerwelt, an absolute milestone. Or Massive Attack, Blue Lines, just to name a few here. Playing as a DJ to me is a game of sending and receiving uh, in the most direct way that you could possibly think of. I mean, you can't get much closer to the audience and um, it, it's such an intimate thing and, and, and a pure exchange of energy and it is really spiritual. I have to say I love doing remixes, I really love it. Um, I, I think it's so exciting to play around with other people's tracks and actually see what I can come up with. It's such great fun, it's, it's fantastic. I really think that the biggest compliment for someone who produces music or plays as a DJ is, um, for example, that people go and, and, and buy your album or come to see you playing at the club at night and appreciate what you create there. And I think that's what it's all about, pretty much.